Hey everyone, I am here with my penny shopping haul. I didn't get as much as I have in previous years, but I'm being more selective in what I take and what I leave for others. Um, there are several new penny shoppers in my area and I would like them to get the opportunity to grab these items. So I went out in West Virginia in PA so that maybe they'd have a better shot at finding things around here. I hope that my new penny shopping folks have found some items and let's get into this hot mess of a display. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll start with like gloves first. I found quite a bit um, of these. I'm sure the UPCs are not gonna help you at this point because there's just so many of them. So don't forget about these, they can be anywhere. A lot of these I found in the clearance section. Some stores start to move stuff there whenever they run out of room. So check there for yours. And if there's bins, I would look behind the bins. Sometimes things get shoved back behind when people are putting the bins back. So keep that in mind. Um, more of these hats. Some of these I've seen on sky shelves, so keep that in mind also and then I got two more of these hats All right we got these sweater socks and I got some of these little lounge socks I thought I think they were mittens um, several pair of you know, those women's cozy socks. I found these in a big ball cardboard box. I was balls deep, you could say. And I found all these socks in that ball box. I basically had to dump it over sideways and kind of like crawl in it. Um, so yeah, it probably looked hilarious, but I had to get the, I had to get them out and I'm not tall enough. So I had to lay it on the ground. All right. <laughs> My penny shenanigans. Oh, I got a couple more of those too in just different colors. Look for, you know, the ribbon and the pink writing and the white tag. I've seen a lot of these on sky shelves as well. I think they get tossed up there because when they first put all the stuff out, they have so much of it. So some of it, you know, they just put the displays on a top shelf and forget about it. And then it goes on sale. So just check everywhere. I mean, Dollar General, it can go anywhere. Um, or I'm not, you can go, you can find things just about anywhere in the store. It doesn't always make sense. These are like texting gloves. And then these are like chenille ones. We'll probably end up donating these to the church so they can get them out to people who need them in the winter time. And more. The gloves aren't that exciting, I know, but I got a whole crap ton of them. So I'll be giving those out. I found a whole bunch of hats this time around. We have got this like plaid one. A lot of these, I think I missed these in previous penny shopping years. Because this is a FW22. We got this patriotic little camo hat that's made out of like this canvas material. And this is an FW21. I got a leopard cap. And this like fuzzy plaid. And blue. So check your cap displays because these can be mixed in 
with the other ones and you don't even really notice or see it. And then there are these little daisy hats. All right, let's continue with crazy things I found on sky shelves. So, oh no, my clothes are gonna fall. Let's push all this over here so I have some room. Okay, so I was at one store and there had already been two ladies in there ahead of me. And the second pair were still scanning things in the aisle. So I went to an aisle that I had remember seeing things on a few days before. And sure enough, I found a bunch of stuff that they missed. <laughs> and this was just on a sky shelf full and it was facing out too. I think that they got so overwhelmed with those pullover Sherpas <laughs> that they forgot about all these. But man, I got lucky. When I was checking out, the cashier was like, there have been two people ahead of you. Where did you find this stuff? And I was like, it was just out on, right out in the open. I don't know. They just missed it. <laughs> so that was kind of exciting. These are all um, thermal bottoms with the exception of one top. Right here, I got a massive finger cut yesterday. Finger cut. Da -da -da -da! I got a massive paper cut yesterday while I was penny shopping. Some piece of cardboard, something like this, sliced open my finger. And I was just holding my hand up like this. Blood was dripping down my hand. I had to hurry up and grab one of these down the dollar aisle to freaking wrap my finger and apply pressure. It was so bad. And then I had to go and clean up droplets of blood from the floor. Like, <laughs> it was pretty gross. But sometimes injuries happen when penny shopping. <laughs> I found some more of um, these peace, love, and good vibes or peace, love, and vibrators t-shirt. I don't know. And it looks like that. It's a pink heart. Oh, it's peace, love, and vibes. Peace, love, and vibrations. I got one of those in that size. And then I got another one. And these are like cropped little t-shirts. But look, the security tag left a massive hole in the front of this one. So that kind of stinks. I'm going to have to sew it. And hopefully, if it's not very noticeable, I'll be able to donate it. But if not, we're going to have to tear it up and use it for rags or something. Considering it has a massive hole in it. Um, I got some long sleeve West Virginia Mountaineers t-shirts. Just look for the long sleeves. The long sleeves are going to be the ones that are gray dot. Um, so I would look through that. And also be careful with the gray dot hats and like the white dot hats, I think. Not all of them are a penny. The majority I found yesterday were full price. So don't just assume because it has it on there that it is a penny because that's not always the case. And I got this one, and it is long sleeve also. I didn't find any Penn State while I was out. So I got Ohio State and WVU. And then I got this one, another Mountaineers, long sleeve. I got one of these pants. These are those Mission Ridge sleep pants. super psyched for these. <laughs> They're huge, but I love them. They're the Buckeyes uh, sweats. They're super, super, super soft. Oh my gosh, the cats are chasing birds, and one of them just dive-bombed into the window. And also, be wary of the tags. If it says 2024, those are full price. You want 2023, 2022, 2021, look for that. Because they do have brand new gray dot out. I got a couple of Ohio State sweatshirts. So that's another one that's just like it. And another one. And then I got Mountaineer sweatshirts. I didn't find any hoodies, but that's all right. And this one's missing the tag, but she gave it to me. 
sometimes you'll have nice employees like that. Other times they'll be very rude and act like they don't know that it's following. <laughs> um, I got these Bobby Brooks pantalones. Some pantaloons. I found these, and these are from last year. Because these are fruit of the loom. And I just saw these chilling on a sky shelf, and I used my little back scratcher, and I pulled them down. And then I got these little Bobby Brooks's. All right, so that's it for the clothing. And I feel like that was so much. That was 10 minutes of me rambling on about knit goods. Okay, I need a sip of coffee. Hold on, guys. Okay. So, I'm sorry. I just covered that up like a dingus. Let's look at more things and stuffs. I got three of the rainbow little water bottles. I don't, I think one of them has to have a tag on the bottom, but the rest of them don't. So remember these, they still got these out there. And there's a unicorn one as well that did have a thing on the bottom, but I don't know where it went. Um, but yeah, the unicorns, rainbows, and flowers. <laughs> Jeez Louise, I'm knocking everything over. Ay, ay, ay. All right, so got some pans. I got a cupcake squishy pin. Well, let me find this. Two dollars. And here's a little unicorn one with a little poppet thing on the end. Those are kind of hard to see, huh? I got a hedgehog. Super cute. Blue dot. And then another little poppet pin. This time I found, I wish I found more of these. I love them so much. They are little keychain notebooks. They're super cute. And I know when my girls were little, they loved to draw so much. They would draw, like I would have tons of notebooks and they would just draw and draw and draw. And I know they would have absolutely loved to have this to just bring with them everywhere. I want to say this is a 2021, so this is super old. Yes, this is FW21. And that is honestly before I even started penny shopping. I just started this in, what, 20, was it 2022 or 2023? I don't remember. I think it might have been the end of 22 into 23. So I haven't even been doing this that long. And in the time that I've started doing it, so many new people have started. So I think it's always cool to share your finds with people, especially new penny shoppers, to show them that not all penny shoppers are greedy, hateful people because... I know people have awful stories about meeting other penny shoppers. I never want that to be the case with me. So I will share my finds with you and I will teach you the tricks of the trade. So if I ever see you in a store, feel free to come talk to me because I will be more than happy to help you with anything. I got some of these little cups. They're tie-dye. These are old too. These are FW22. I forgot about these last year, and so I've had my eyeball on them just waiting and waiting for them to finally go to a penny, and they did. And then there's this one that says, but first coffee. Check your NCI sections for these. I have found these in the NCI section. That's the only place I found them. Um, but also check with your green dot, your purple dot, any cups, like, you know, drinkware, whatever. Just check those areas. They could be mixed in. Hi, Miss Kitty. I got one of the Peace, Love, and Vibes bags, which I love this because it's the big happy face. And it just brings me back to, you know, being a kid in the 90s. And I love Nirvana. So, hey, you know, this is perfect. I will just carry, maybe I'll bring this penny shop in so then I don't have to use plastic bags. All right, guys. What else? What else? What else? Um... Whoa, dropping things as usual. I got this little squishy notebook. These were $5, but I didn't have the tag. But at another store, the employee was very nice and just scanned something else and gave it to me. So thank you so much. I appreciate employees like that. You're awesome. Um, I got scrunchies. This is like a satiny pink one. Another one. Leopard. 
this like weird tweedish fabric. I don't know. It feels really cool though. And then this is like a corduroy one that I I bought one of these during the clearance event. I got claw clips. Those two are the same. And then I got some of these. I found one little necklace. I got one of these gigantic highlighter pens. I got our little color squishies. I got a whole thing of these little keychains. I found some of these. These are the phone cord hair bands. <laughs> and this little pom-pom wristlet one. I think this was in my video that I showed you um, when I went to look for 90% off items. These are, the, I love these so much, and I'm so happy I found a whole container of them. Um, they're different kind of little acrylic happy faces. This is my favorite one. I love it. So I'm going to change my keychain up. I have it right now as a little, um, that macrame cactus. But I'm actually going to trade it in for one of these because these are adorable. And then there's this one with like star eyes. And I think the rest of them are all that star one. So they're the same. So remember those. Look out for those. And these were just, these were in the clearance section just like this. I was quite shocked. Okay. And I'm still finding a couple Easter items here and there. I found two more of these. There's the other one. I got three of the command hooks. And of course, you know, I was finding these everywhere when they weren't a penny, and now I can't find them anywhere. <laughs> it's so annoying. There's that. I found quite a few of these decals, and these were down the toy aisle, so you really never know where stuff is going to be. We got a the Hulk. We've got Mickey Mouse. Monster Jam. Paw Patrol. Oh. I'm too old to be sitting on the floor, I think, y'all. All right, I got three of these little Peace, Love, and Vibes pouch, which I did haul these when they were 90%, um, I think, or like 75, something like that. I found one pair of little um, Mickey Mouse sunglasses that make you look like maybe you're Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I got three of these little insulation packs for, they're like the shrink packs for your windows. My grandpa used to put these up every year in his house. I don't know if they worked or anything, but I mean, they must have if you put them up every year. I got one of these little cord safe guys. I found some more food. I found both the blue diamond almonds. And I found a Lucinda. <laughs> Lou. Lucy. Hi, baby. There's the lightly salted. Whoop, she just jumped. Jolly Ranchers, the all peach. And you should be good on a lot of the candy and the almonds because they are not out of date. At least the ones I've found. Well, I mean, that just expired, but no one checks, thank God. I, there's one man who checks at one store. Um, but that's it. I've never had anyone else check the dates. 
We got more of our little penny chips. And those are not expired yet, so that's cool. Don't forget to check for these where they sell like the little cooler bags and stuff. Sometimes they even have these near the front door where they're trying to sell them. And you might see one of these mixed in. I think there's another color that's like this too. Um, but these are blue dot. Hello, what are you doing over there? I found one of these snack savers. Um, it, you put batteries in it and I guess it like automatically seals your bag. I don't know. Very, very interesting. I'm going to have to try it and see if it actually works. And I got a bajillion of the four in one plastic drinking glasses. So there is the UPC on those guys. You can find these anywhere. These could be anywhere in the store at this point, honestly. I've even found them in the automotive department. <laughs> um, I got two forts in a can. Stink free sound effects. Oh, it's upside down. And that's pretty funny. All right, so if you are in desperate need of a fart in a can, Dollar General has you covered. <laughs> Ma'am, Lula Bees. She was drinking my coffee earlier because I had whipped cream on the top. I had to hurry up and take it from her. All right, guys, that is it for my haul. I will probably go back out in the next couple days and go search around. I really just wanted to give other petty shoppers in my area a chance. And it, I don't need to hit up 14 stores every time things go to a penny. Like, you only need so much. So... I hope you guys have a great day and happy penny hunting. Bye.